exteriors, roofing, siding, windows, and gutters. All right, we are back at quarter before 7 o'clock, Thursday, the 17th day of December. And though 31 is kind of chilly, we should be starting off in the upper teens right now. So still way above normal. The problem is it actually feels about like that outside with these northwest winds at 12. So I got a cloudy, breezy, cool start to the day. In fact, temperatures have slipped back to 30 in Lincoln. The common number from Columbus to Norfolk all morning long at 27. Right now, Dennis and I are with 28. But as I flip the map, you'll see the numbers go down quite a bit. Uh, the wind chill factor for both Dennis and Atlantic in the upper teens. You step out in Omaha, it feels like 22. And the current wind chill factor in Lincoln right now at 21. All right, here's an in-close look again. La Vista Papillion on back toward Ralston, South Omaha, all socked in with the low clouds. And we're actually seeing clouds as you go up above that. Some mid-level clouds, the brighter white on top there. But still nothing thick enough to produce rain, snow, or any ice for us. So that's good news. There has been a little bit of light snow and a few flurries into western Kansas. That's about it, though. All the moisture up toward the Great Lakes and way out over the Pacific Northwest at the current time. So for us, probably the biggest stumbling block, clouds and the winds today. Temperatures forecast to slip a little bit below 30 this morning, and then we'll gradually climb back into the low to mid 30s this afternoon. Evidence here, we're going to try to thin out the overcast. That may be tough to do. Wouldn't be shocked, kind of like yesterday, if we get a few breaks and a little sunshine, especially this afternoon. We should clear off tonight. That's going to allow for temperatures to really drop and then we'll start to move back up the temperature ladder as we head through the weekend. So not a horrible forecast for mid-December, to say the least. We'll shoot for about 35 this afternoon. Northwest winds 10 to 20 still make it feel like it's in the 20s with wind chill factors. Tonight will actually drop to 20, and unfortunately, as skies turn partly cloudy, we won't completely lose the wind out of the west at 5 to 15. So wind chill factors this time tomorrow morning, probably in the upper single digits to low teens. It does get better tomorrow with less wind and more sun. We'll be at about 38. And then our forecast for Saturday through the weekend shows the pattern kind of shifts. In fact, we'll see a nice little ridge of high pressure build in and then much warmer weather conditions, probably 10 to 15 degrees above normal Saturday and probably 15 close to 20 above normal as we head towards Sunday. So uh, looking much better there. In fact, highs may make a run at 50 on Sunday. Uh, cloud cover has me holding that back to about 48. And then though a weak front moves by with the sprinkle and more clouds late Sunday into Monday, temperatures stay mild through the first half of next week. That's great for travel. Probably not the best news for a white Christmas, but stay tuned. We're still about a week away, so a lot can change as we head closer to that time frame. All right, that's the seven day forecast.